is, hi guys, <laughs> here is my tub outside. We can now see the fish. I'm, I fed, just fed them so I could see that everybody's okay. I got lots of babies in here. Growing up babies. But I had to remove a lot of the duckweed <laughs> so that I could even see them. My crawfish is in here somewhere. He's hiding probably in the moss. Um, that's what makes the bottom look so dirty is the moss that broke apart. But, um, little babies. Oh, but they're eating, but I'll show you all of the duckweed I had to remove so that we could even see the fish. There it is, guys. All the duckweed I removed. And there's still duckweed in there, but this covers the entire surface of this tub. Look how thick it is. But, uh, and the duckweed I left in there will still multiply, so I'm not even going to really put a lot of this back in. This could be duckweed that I sell. Like, it just goes boom. Like crazy. Like, this is thick duckweed here. A little thinner on this side because you can see the water, but <laughs> yep. But I was like, I can't even enjoy my fish anymore because I can't see them. So <laughs> take away some of the duckweed, and there you go. Yeah, I think the crawfish is. Uh, oh no, he's over here. He's behind the heater. There he is. He's a blue crawfish. He's just, you can't see the color when he's down there. So there he is. Bella, come here. But everybody look, I don't look like I'm missing anybody significant. I recognize, I mean, if I lost any of the young plain looking ones, I don't see bodies down there. Um, but I recognize my mollies and my uh, male and female guppies. So they're still all there. My quarry is still down there. And earlier today I saw the Pleco, so I know he's still good. Yeah. So this, this is probably what I started out with in duckweed when I first brought it home. Crazy how much it spread. There's my quarry. But yeah, crazy, crazy. But yeah, that's just an update on my little tub. My fish are doing well. Now I can enjoy looking at them again. <laughs> I've removed all the duckweed. But anyway, just a little update on that. And if any of you pray, um, just please pray for me. Um, a lot of issues at home right now, um, to the point that I'm actually ready to leave. So, um, it's not a good situation. Um, things need to change. And I'm hoping that changes will happen without me actually leaving. So, <laughs> it's been a really rough, rough time this last week or so but I mean it's been rough all along I've just been kind of trying to go along with it and you know whatever because I don't have any say in it but that's what's pushing me to the brink is that I don't have any say in it and I'm not good with that anymore so yeah anyway Hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will talk with you later. Bye, guys.